thing to me when you get to this point of the season is you're trying to end a senior's career. And in women's softball, for the most part, they're done with the game. And that's the hardest thing to do when it gets to this round, the next round, and even the World Series. So I can't tell you how much uh, <coughs> respect I have for them, their coaching staff. Their, the kid on the mound was unbelievable. Um, you know, I got to see her and then uh, two summers ago up in Toronto at the Pan Am Games when she beat USA. And, you know, I, I can remember saying to Haley McClenney's mom and dad, man, I hope we never see them. Because it's always, you know, the, the matchups are the, the keys when you get to this round. And she obviously is one of her, if not the best pitcher in the country. And to have to beat her twice was just an incredible feat for us. And on the other hand, I'm so proud of Sydney. Uh, for coming out uh, today and doing what she did. Lexi finishing it, Runyon a senior, Chandler a senior. I mean, that's a hell of a way to go out at home. So um, it was just a, just a great regional all around. And to me, this was like one of the most satisfying, I don't know how many we won, but it's right up there up the top. Yeah, that's always the goal to score first. Um, we were the away team, and I mean, it was it was different. You know, obviously we're not used to that playing at home, but uh, we just really want to attack first. Um, and so the first inning, like, I mean, I wanted to be up there. I wanted the bat in my hands. Um, I trusted my approach, and um, I was ready to, you know, get that first RBI. Were you looking to go off the field there? Or? You know, actually the game plan was in. Um, they stayed in yesterday and so that was actually my plan um but i believe those two strikes and you know just had to protect and um just that happened again well, right? it was mm -hmm. you, you seem to have been making pretty good contact with her uh, a lot of you know, change up and everything else you seem to be really honored and you feel that mm -hmm. about both games yeah i mean well credit to coach ally she uh really uh buys into the preparation and all week um we did, you know, prepare for what we were going to see this weekend, and um, so I started to show slap, and I feel very comfortable with that, and um, so that was, you know, the adjustment that I made, and I felt like I was seeing the ball well with that, so I stuck with it. Did you think Chandler was going to score all the way from first No, <laughs> I wasn't too sure, but um, I'm glad she did. <laughs> oh my gosh, defense was great and amazing and I that's the reason that I feel like I was so effective is because I knew that they were going to make the plays behind me I didn't have any worries you know it's always nice whenever you score first because then you're like all right you know I can go out there and I can just put in work I don't have to really worry about anything and from the get-go the defense started making plays and I just I knew that I was comfortable to get in my zone then and they were just outstanding and it was exciting to see. What's that feeling like I mean being the visitors in your own park you've probably never been in that situation Oh, it was great. It was an awesome feeling, you know, uh, especially going out to the first inning and then just going three up, three down. That's whenever, you know, it's almost kind of like it puts the pressure on to them. And that's what we wanted to do. And it was awesome for the defense. You know, they got three quick outs and we scored in that first inning. So I feel like we were able to jump on them quick and kind of put them on their heels. I think Lex and I are great counterparts. You know, we work very well to together, as well as Maddie. You know, we really complete each other, the three of us together. And whenever you do have the three of us together and we're on, we're like a three-headed monster, I feel like. You know, we just, our goal is always to go at people, and we just want to attack the zone. And I felt like Lex did an amazing job of that this weekend, and Maddie and I as well. And we were just able to follow up that performance. When did you know you were getting the ball, and how were you going? Uh, Marv told me. <laughs> Uh, but he told me uh, in the huddle before the game, not before the game, but before we started warming up, that's Indian Reagan. So, and I mean, I, I kind of had a feeling, you know, talking to Jesus last night. And I was just <laughs> like, all right, if I get the ball tomorrow, like, let's go. So. And it was a foul ball, but how big was Rachel's catch? Well, what y'all don't know is that she does that in practice all the, time, all the time. I knew as soon as I saw her out there in left field and I saw that ball, I was like, oh, that's an out. Nobody else knows it. This is about to be great. You know, as it was falling down, I was like, this is going to be great. 
And, you know, that's just another thing that the world hasn't seen her do that yet. And so I was so happy for her in that moment because that was a difference maker to this game. I mean, we're going to soak in this win. Um, I've been, we both, you know, all three of us have been blessed to be a part of this program for four years. And I know for a fact that we're leaving better people than what we came in as. And, um, you know, we're going to soak in this win and then get prepared for this weekend. You know, coming in, you're playing out. Seeing things being what they are, you get the number one team and coaches fold in this. And now you get the team the number one of the year and number one season. How do you feel about before she answers that, can she answer his about last game on the field? Uh, as far as the last game on the field, you know, I got a little emotional right after we clinched the win there. But this program and these fans and this atmosphere has been undoubtedly the best in the country. And I'm so blessed and so thankful to have been a part of such a great program. And, you know, now I'll have to come back as an alumni to see the girls play on this field. But, you know, I can't wait to cheer on everybody else that comes through here for I guess as long as I'm alive, I'm gonna come out here. Old lady is still cheering on these girls, you know. And I just, I can't wait to see what we have left the rest of this season moving forward. Can you repeat your question? I'm yeah, sorry. just having to play the number one team now, you earned the chance to go play the number one team. Um, how do you feel about getting through this, knowing that, and then what kind of confidence do you guys take? Well, you know, people say we have the hardest road to the women's college world series, but how else would you want to get there? You know, we beat an amazing Minnesota program two times and knowing that we can do that you know that gives us confidence going into Florida and they're also the number you know they're now that they're the number one seeded team well if we can beat them twice and advance to the World Series and I'm not gonna say it's an easy road at the World Series but that's just a, even more of a confidence booster so you know it's just one of those things that's we're gonna earn our way to the World Series and that's that's how we look at it mm -hmm. this, is, this is the first time y'all are actually on the road for for, oh, for us, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. I guess so. What do you kind of expect of that experience? Kind of having to earn it that way. You know, I mean, I'm excited. It's different. Um, of course, it's so much fun playing at home. Our fans are incredible. But uh, you know, why not take the hard route? You know, if we're going to make it to the World Series, take the hard route. You know, I rather much. I'd rather do that than say, oh, they got it easy. And so um, I know we're ready to go and we'll be prepared. Yeah, they say nothing worth having comes easy, so why not go into Florida? And you know, I think all, the whole team is excited to be able to go in there because we didn't get to we didn't get to play them this year, and so going in there, you know, we have a week to prepare, and I guarantee you we're going to be confident and ready to go. You guys aren't scared of Florida, are you? No. <laughs> no. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> you guys can go. Oh, okay. Just come around, Brown. Come around it. There. Holdner? No. No, I didn't think we'd get many chances, and that was a huge chance with the double in the gap and one of the fastest girls on the team running, no doubt. You know, if they make a play, they make a play. Yeah, I mean, they, they were terrific. And, you know, Stephanie Prothrow has done a great job with them this year, and I mean, she did exactly what we wanted her to do, is to go as far as she could. And because I really, I really didn't want to use Lex again today, but um, in the dugout, I think in the fifth, I said, you know, how are you feeling? And she said she was fine. So she went to warm up in the bottom of the fifth, I think. And then um, just with the combination that was up to bat, we felt it was a good time to bring Lexi in. And, um, and then Booker made a great play at shortstop, so it worked. I know. I was faster than Chandler down the line, I think. <laughs> no, it's fine. Yeah, she's fast, but have you ever seen her turn faster? Probably not. No, it was it was great to see. I need to see it again though. I don't I, I wanna see how close it was. How did you feel after getting that run, knowing you had sitting on the mound, you know, one run, that's all you needed last night. Mm -hmm. I, I mean I I I mean I knew it was gonna be low scoring again, you know. They have a great pitching staff too, and that kid is just unbelievable. You know, that was, you guys saw one of the best changeups I've ever seen in college softball. And I mean, you saw how it fooled batter after batter. I mean, it's just, it's almost an unhittable pitch. And I wish I could learn how to throw it, how she does it. 
But, um, you know, our pitching staff's just been terrific all year long. And, you know, I said to the media on Thursday, I, I don't know if you guys um, were here, but Sydney's given us a quality start every single time. And I don't know how many starts that was for her, but every time she's gone out, she's kept us in the game, and she did it again today. She pretty well handled uh, Mack and uh, making at the top of their lineup, uh, who had been on base even in the first game basically all weekend. Um, was that the most the better? I know they got a lot of good batters. But... I mean, it was a key because I still think the, the three hole is just a great hitter too, Lindemann. And to keep the top of the lineup off, um, that was big. I, I don't I don't know I don't I'm not sure I know that both I mean they're both all Americans we have two all Americans on our staff and Osorio is going to be an all American again I mean no doubt and their kids the first team all American but to have the luxury of the two that we have both have been second team all American in their career um, they came to play and, and both of them did exactly what we wanted them to do I mean they hit their spots they limited the walks they limited the pitches and uh, made Minnesota hit the ball. Oh, I think so. I mean, it's huge. I mean, they're they're a great team too. I mean, they have great pitchers as well. So we're gonna we're just gonna keep seeing great pitching the whole way through. I mean, between us two and and their two or three and Grown Wagon. I mean, that's that's like some of the best pitchers in the country in in three teams. How do you feel about keeping the streak of going to Super Regionals alive and thirty something odd? That's unbelievable. I mean, it's a credit to all the players. Uh, like Runyon said, Allie does a hell of a job of preparing the hitters all week long. Um, the crowd, we couldn't do it without the crowd. They, they were but, awesome. Uh, we're still the only school in the country that's gone to all 13 Super Regionals now, so it's a hell of a feat.